Okay, good morning, everybody. Um, today, I, I'm going to be going over a way to create a video that you can use on social media um, pretty easily using image files and some music. We're going to use uh, an app that I've that I use a lot that I like a lot called Quick. Um, and what I'm going to do here, I'm going to share my phone because uh, this is something that you can do just just on your phone uh, makes it really easy. So hang on one second while I do that. Uh, okay. Okay, one second. Okay. So everybody should should be seeing um, my 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 phone now. Good. Everybody see my phone? I don't know whether that's your phone. <laughs> I see yeah, it, it is my phone. There, yeah, there it is. Okay. Yeah. Uh, here we go. All right, cool. All right, so you guys can all see my phone I'm just on a, a main screen. Um, so what app I'm going to be using, uh, I'm just going to click on the App Store. And if you have an Android, uh, it's there available for you as well. So if you do a search, it's, it's quick, um, but spelled Q-U-I-K. And it's this one right here where it says quick GoPro video editing. Um, and as you can even see by the little sample that they have underneath this, uh, you can, it's, it's really made by GoPro, which is a video system. Um, so I'm going to use images today to create a video, but you can also use it to do some video editing. If you have some short video that you took, maybe you took some video of a house uh, as you're walking up, uh, just like quick little clips. Uh, you can do that as well. Um, that might be a, something I might try next time. Next time I have a house uh, that I can kind of go through, just take some short video, maybe a, um, you know, five seconds of the kitchen, uh, five seconds of uh, another room and so on, so on and so forth. Um, apologize for my, my home phone ringing, um, which we never answer. But I'm going to go ahead and hit this open button next to, next to quick. Uh, and if you did not downloaded that on your phone before, uh, you would just download that and, and, and launch that from your phone. Um, you can see some old videos that I've done in here. Uh, we are going to create a new one. The one thing when I'm sharing my phone, uh, you can't see what I'm actually clicking on in my phone. So I'm going to try to tell you where I click. So at the bottom here, I'm going to click on the plus button. Uh, and it did actually kind of uh, flash for you. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to go into, uh, I just kind of favorited some, some pictures here in a folder. Uh, what I'm going to try to accomplish today, uh, for those of you who were with me when I did the customized email uh, that I sent out to my sphere of influence for Moxie to campaign the, uh, the build your own evil ask. I, I built something that talked about what houses I sold and how I was happy to help those clients. I'm gonna do something similar into a video because uh, what, what I did on Moxie was great for an email blast, but doesn't work very well in doing a, uh, a social media post. Uh, so I'm gonna kind of turn that into a video. So to start, I, all I did was hit the plus button and now it's asking me, you know, which photos I would like to include uh, in my, my video that I'm gonna create. Uh, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try to create an order here that I'd like to do. So I'm gonna click that one. Let's try that. This, uh, that one, this one, this one, this one. All right, so I chose seven. I usually I usually try to do about five to eight pictures, um, and you can change the length. So I'm gonna up on the top right. There's a button that says Add, and uh, in parentheses it says Seven because I selected seven photos. 
Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and hit add seven. And automatically it starts, it, it loaded my pictures and it, and it put it into, you know, some type of video editing. Uh, as I scroll through this bar, there are different formats you can use. So I'm just going to click on Grammy and you're going to see that's actually, it looks like a pretty good one kind of focusing through the pictures. Um, but there's action. Um, well, I like the Grammy because it wasn't. All right, cool. I could turn the volume down on my phone and it won't play up very much. Um, so there is, there is music attached as well. So each one of these videos are a little bit different and we can change them later. Uh, let's just see if we can pick one that I want to start with. Uh, I kind of like the lapse here because it kind of goes in and out on the photo. So let's go ahead and start with that. Let's hit save. Uh, so on the bottom right, there's a blue button, say save. Oh, sorry, wrong button. We didn't want to do that. Um, what we want to do um, to, the, to the left of save, uh, we can click on uh, music, uh, the slides. So I'm going to click on the one in the middle, which is the slides. And there we go. All right, so I, I clicked on the slides on the, the, that's the middle button all the way at the bottom. And then from there, you can, you can click on any one of these pictures, as you can see, any one of these slides. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna add text. So I'm gonna click on the first one. So there is a little header that it did. Um, and I'm kind of going to my notes here on my computer screen. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna write, and, and it kind of knew where one of the pictures were taking. So it put in a visiting Coatesville. Uh, so I'm going to say the, this is kind of long, so let's see if it all fits. The best part of my job is helping people sell their house so they can find their or ever home. All right, so let's see if that works. Oh, yeah, that works great. All right, so that fit into my first slide. Uh, so I do have the best part of my job is helping people sell their house so they that so that they can find their forever home homes. Uh, open up on their house forever home. That's perfect. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to slide to the next picture here. And now I have some options on the bottom where it says text, delete, adjust, focus. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select text. Now I can actually write something. So this one was, oh, now I can't remember which house it was. Okay, so this is, this is an Ollie and Jen's house. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna write that. So I'm gonna hit text. And Chris, is something should change on your screen because there's like I don't see any action. I mean, you don't see this. Oh, right now something has changed. Okay, I mean, do you see Ollie? And, oh, yes. I'm sorry. Yeah, do you guys tell me if something's not working there? Um, hold on. You guys should all be. I'm sharing my phone, so you should be seeing my phone. Mm -hmm. Where it says Ollie and Jen? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, but you couldn't see it a minute ago? Yeah. Okay. I wonder if it's, uh, what, did you see my notes that I was on my computer? Do you saw this? Yes. Oh, okay. All right. One second. All right, now I have my notes and I have this. Okay, so is that good? You can see that? Mm -hmm. You can see Ollie and Jen, yeah. Okay, good. So we're gonna hit, we're gonna type Ollie and Jen, 
And now you can also, it looks like you can also see my notes on the right. So I'm gonna write uh, Chester Springs and I'm gonna hit okay. Uh, now we're gonna go to the next house. We're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna click on text. Uh, this was Vera and Anthony return. Um, and that is Glenmore. Did I spell Glenmore? Two O's? Yes, ma'am, the worst speller in the world. Okay. <laughs> it kind of, uh, I'll, I'll check it later. It kind of, the, the, the spell check it changed it for me. Um, all right, so this is, this is Santosh and Priya. And Count Township. Okay. Go to the next one. Uh, this is Dan and Aaron. And we're going to do East Fallowfield. Okay. And just two more. And and, and in Austin, and that's Downingtown. Okay. Uh, this is Jessica and Jack, East Fowlfield. So a lot of what I've done in the past has been more for um, like a listing promotion where I would put a picture of uh, the, you know, the kitchen or what have you and did like a just listed or just sold uh, something like that. So I wanted to kind of show another way to do this where we can do, you know, really kind of a just sold, but it's really a promotion about, about me or obviously could be about you and count township okay all right i think that was my last one okay so let's hit okay all right it kind of started at the end you guys see the video yeah so we're just gonna let it play I flip my, my phone back around. Uh, let me tell it not to play again. What do you guys think? Can everybody see the video? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Not bad. Something really, really easy to do. And what we could do, we can also go back. That was laps. Um, we can try other things. I kind of like this one better. Yeah, it doesn't have the birds over the house. Yep. <laughs> so that was boxed. So we can just, we can kind of flip through all this. And you could change the music if you like one of the uh, and it's, uh, it's kind of like an old timesy. And this is this is for free, my Chris. Just uh, hold on, I can't hear you that very well with the music playing. Let me just stop it. 
I'm sorry. You can create these videos in a free version or you have to buy some? No, this is all free. Okay. This That's is all free. Cool. Yeah, so um, I think you guys get the point. Um, I think we, the box one was pretty cool. So let's, let's kind of finish up from there. Um, so some other options down at the bottom um, is music. And you can, each one of these default templates, if you will, have their own video, but if you don't, or audio, if you don't like one of the audios, you can, you can switch them. I'm not gonna mess with it. I'm just gonna tell you, you can do that. We're gonna leave that alone. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, now, the one thing I did want to say is when I added these, when I added all these photos, um, I did mention in the beginning of this class that this is a this is a video editor. So any one of these videos that I added, uh, and I just added them obviously just from my camera roll on my phone, uh, I could have added short videos, and you could do a combination of. So maybe you had a you know short video of some clients. Um, you know, walking up to their, their house, or you just had some, you know, or if you were doing a new just listed, uh, you could just do, like I said, do some clips of each room and put together, you know, maybe a, you know, minute long video uh, that you can post on social media and also put in, um, in bright uh, as, as a, like a walking tour. So you can create your own walking tour. Uh, so there's a lot of different things you can do in here. Um, the last thing I'm going to do you know, I'm going to hit the save button and then you have an option to do all these fun things where you can share it to Instagram, Instagram stories, Facebook, what have you. Um, what I like to do is um, just the, the second from the bottom photo library. Mm -hmm. If you click on photo library, <clears throat> it creates the video as you can see, and it's saving to my photo library library and it says success. I can hit done. Uh, when I do come back into this video, you can see it. It is it's right here on the top. Um, but if I go into my photos, I'm in favorites right now. Now you can see the last the last thing in my photos here is this video. Can you guys see that? Yeah. Yes. Okay. So. It's, 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 it's a video on my phone. And then from there, you can upload this to, you can still upload it to Instagram and Instagram stories or Facebook. Um, but you also could, because it's a video on your phone, uh, you can upload it to your YouTube channel and create a video for Bright MLS. Um, you can, because it's on your phone and it's really an MP4 file, you can do anything you want with it. Um, the other thing I really like about the way by putting it onto your phone here, um, by doing that, when you upload to Facebook or other social media, as people are scrolling through um, their, their stories, their, their, um, uh, their news feed, uh, when they get to your video, it's going to automatically play. It's not, you're, you would not post a YouTube link of your video to social media. You would post it directly from your phone like you would any picture, any video, um, which would enable it to automatically play as they're taking it through social media. Um, mm -hmm. So if I wanted to post this, I could just go to, here's my business page. It doesn't have to be your business page, but here's my business page. Um, and I would just come right down to create a post, click on that. I uh, hit photo video and, and then the last thing in my video is this 30 second, 36 second video. I'm gonna select that, hit done. And you can see it is, it is putting it into Facebook. Uh, and then it's as simple as like say something, happy to help. Um, and you could just leave it alone as that. And now it's, I can, let me hit the play button. It is in there, see? Uh, and I can go ahead and hit post. Let's, and I'm gonna hit publish. And 
and let's see what happens. Now that is a video, so it might take you know a minute. Chris, was there a microphone on that? One of the choices for you to speak. I'm sorry. Was there a choice of you speaking on the on the video? I thought uh, I saw. I don't think so. You know, if you wanted to talk over or something. Yeah, it looked like there was a microphone, but my eyes are oh, crazy. Maybe there was. Well, hold on. Let's go look. All right, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start over real quick and just hit um, favorites. I'm just gonna choose like a couple pictures, two pictures, add two. Oh, it says you need to add at least five. That's why I've always added five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, add five. And let's go to the- What's the thing right before save? Uh, that's a little tool, tool chest. Um, oh, okay, I thought that was a microphone. I told you my eyes are crazy. Oh, you can play your own music. Okay, yeah, not a microphone. Okay. But, but I mean, if you're, if you are doing this from, uh, well, let's go back to Facebook real quick, see if it posted. There, there it is. See, so as, as people scroll through their feed, it'll show up. That's cool. There you go. Yeah. If anybody, any of you like my page, it might show up as you scroll through. Um, all right, let me take off this. Just stop sharing real quick. Um, so uh, what I was gonna say, Terry, um, if you were taking clips of video that you were uploading, because again, you could upload video um, as opposed to pictures, or in combination of pictures. So if you had a quick video that you were taking of a kitchen, you could talk, obviously when you're taking the video or your phone, you could talk and say, here's a beautifully remodeled kitchen. And it could be a three second video of you just saying, here's a beautifully remodeled kitchen, pan over, do that, then stop your video. And that could be one of the things that you input into this and um, the audio would play in there if you wanted the audio to play. Um, or, or maybe you could just, you want the audio, the music to play over top of here. So you, you have a couple options there. What questions do you guys have? No, thank you. That's kind of cool. Up. I think I might've missed one thing. What's that? So you, when you were on the picture, the picture with that little, um, uh, pencil or whatever is that how you got got the information on the right picture um like sorry, when let, you me, let me share it. again one second okay you guys see my phone yes okay let's see where we were um what was your question I wasn't sure how you got the right information on the right picture. Oh, okay. So I have my slides in here. Um, the first tab that I'm, I kind of see the blue bar all the way to the left, that's where you can pick your, your different, your different <laughs> um, templates. Uh, music is second. So I'm going to see how I skip the music. And the third one, the one in the middle, it looks like slides. That's what mm -hmm. it's supposed to look like. Then from there, you can you can scroll to any picture. So let's say you go to this picture and you see a little pencil show up. Okay. You can just click on the pencil. And then from there, there's a text all the way at the bottom left where it has a little A. Yes. The text. And then you can you can put anything you want in there and then that'll show up over your picture. Perfect. Yeah, I missed that part. <laughs> um, and then you also have all, like, if you have delete, like if you want to delete a picture, you can do that. Um, if you, 
when you're looking at this picture to the left and right, there's also a plus button. You could go back if you wanted to add another another picture in the middle of your video or in the mm -hmm. middle of doing this and you you're like realized you needed one more. You could just click on those buttons before or after and just you can go right into here and, and add something. Perfect. Right there. Um, you can adjust it, you can focus. Um, then there's also what I didn't tell you was uh, duration. So you can also, you know, like here, duration, uh, regular, <laughs> long, or short. So it doesn't really give you a timer, but it gives you, uh, if you felt one of the, you know, if one picture you want to stay on longer, you can make that longer and then, you know, make the other ones regular or short, um, which might help in your flow if you had a really nice picture you'd like to show. Or if you took, you can always do a slide in the middle of this with, with words. Maybe you want to, you know, write a little paragraph like I kind of did in that video. Um, if you want that to be a little bit longer, you can do that. Um, then you also have focus. If you want to, you know, show where, where the camera wants to shoot, if uh, something seems to be off. So you have a couple other options, but what, what's really nice about this, oops. What's really nice about this is there's not a ton of options. Obviously, if you're using some fully functional um, software, uh, video editing software, it can be very cumbersome and confusing and everything. This is something that you could do, you know, in a waiting room, you know, while you're sitting there on your phone for as long as you have the pictures on your phone, something you can do in 10 minutes. Uh, and, you know, we, I basically did that in, you know, five or 10 minutes and posted it to Facebook already and it's out there. Um, so now when yeah, you, it's pretty easy to when do. You did, when you did your little, um, uh, in, little your little message. Yes. Uh, you weren't on a picture to do that, correct? I was not. Um, the, the way this formats, uh, they usually have a title screen. Oh, okay. Like title a black screen. title screen. Uh, so I use the title screen. So it does have a black background. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, anybody else have any questions? No, thank you very much. Well, thank you for thank you all for joining me, and uh, hope you got a little bit of something out of this. And you know, it's something you just want to play around with a couple times. You can do these videos um, and not publish them, and just practice and do a few and and play around with them. And, you know, then when you get a final product that you like, then go ahead and share it on Facebook, social media. This was a okay. fun. Is there a maximum amount of pictures you can put on? Probably, I, I haven't gotten to it. Um, I don't think you, it, when, when you're looking at videos that you're sharing on social media, you don't want these videos to really be over, you know, 30 to 45 seconds is what they're say. People's <laughs> will actually hang in there for so. Yeah. I think you can make it longer, um, but I probably wouldn't. Okay. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. Well, thank you all for joining me, and I'll okay. talk to you soon. Okay. Have a good day. You. you too. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. Thank you.